What's up everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today's video we have some boxes right here to open. So let's go ahead and roll that intro and let's get this video started. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, I have some packages to open. I have three packages right here in front of me that need to be opened. This one right here from the Shumi store. This one right here from Pops Comics and Collectibles. And this one from Macari. Even though it says Amazon. From Macari. Alright, which one should we open first? Before I open any of them, I do want to show you that I got the Black Widow uh, Marvel Collector Core box, which I didn't think I was going to get. I thought I canceled, but it showed up on my doorstep, and I'm actually wearing a shirt right now. So I'm going to show you really quick what was inside the box. You've probably seen it already, but I'm just going to do a quick um, this, that, this, that. Here is the shirt. That was one thing. It's pretty cool. We got this pin here. That looks pretty cool. We got a Red Guardian decal. A Black Widow Pop. There it is right there. A Alexi Pop right there. Pretty cool. So that was it. That was all that I got from the Marvel Collector Core Box. I didn't want to make a whole dedicated video because I don't know. I don't think anybody would be interested in watching that. So I didn't record a video. So so which one do we want to open first? I want to open the Shumi one because I'm definitely excited about that. Let's open the big box here. We're just going to go ahead and attack the Macari box. See what's actually in here. Because I know this is not from Amazon. It is from Macari. Oh, nicely packaged. I, I give them A plus on packaging. That is some prime packaging. I don't even, I've never seen this packaging before in my life. But pretty good. Oh, okay. Alright. I remember what it is now. Alright. Nice, nice, nice. Alright. I, look at that level of packaging. Jeez, that's that's just unreal. I did pick this up because yeah, I am a huge fan of the Wayne's World. Look at those guys. It's Wayne's World. I definitely like this. I did miss out on uh, whenever they had the Target Con happening. I did miss out on the Wayne's World, but I, I got them now. That's pretty cool. I do have the other ones over there, I believe, somewhere. Yeah, right there. Wayne and Garth. Party on, Wayne! Party on, Garth. It's Wayne's World! Wayne's World! There it is right there, Wayne's World. It's a really freaking cool pop. Uh, heck yeah, I, I'm really excited for this one. Uh, yeah, definite, definite must in my collection. I like some of the older like movie pops and stuff, so yes, this makes a great addition to my collection. And this is like my second two-pack. Show me. So let's go ahead and hit up Pops Comics and Collectibles and see what they're working with this time. I did get uh, three Pops, I do believe, and I think they said they were going to put a comic in, the one I was looking for, but I'm not 100% on that. They're $11 a piece, or you can buy three Pops for um, 30 I think that's what it was. And yeah, as always, they have tremendous packaging. I really like them. There's box one, box two, and box three. So let's just move out off to the side. We don't need that no more. What do you think they are? What do you think could be inside these boxes right here? I'm not sure. I know what it is. I know what it is. All right, so we're going to head and look at one right now. All right, so these were uh, $11 a piece or three for 30. So in three, two, one, bam. Okay, yeah. All right. Yes, ladies and gentlemen. Woo! All right, so this is Mr. Shaquille O'Neal himself. I was a huge fan of Shaquille O'Neal back in the day, as well as Michael Jordan, which I do have a few Michael Jordan pops over there. So this is going to be another one in the collection of um, my sports, I guess, collection, I guess. I still want to try to get, like, Larry Bird and some of the original ones from the 90s. So there is that right there, uh, Mr. Shaquille O'Neal. That looks really magnificent. I thought he was going to be taller than that, but I guess not. Moving on to the next pop. This one is kind of substantial. It's kind of heavy. I forget what this might be. I forget what this is. All right, so in three, two, one. Bam. What is it? Oh, yeah, okay. All right, all right, all right, all right. Yes. It is none other than 
Shota Aizawa from My Hero Academia. That is really cool. I do have, I do already do have this one, but the box is kind of wrecked on the side, like you can put your finger through it. So I did want to get another one because the box was in better condition. So yeah, I might swap out the boxes and get one out of box, I guess. That'd be pretty cool. But uh, Shota Aizawa, really cool, really awesome. That leaves this one right here. Now this one could be a little controversial. Uh, some people like this guy, some people don't. I think what he's done for the gaming community is pretty awesome and if you know who I'm talking about and it is a pop figure, you probably know who this guy already is. So I'm going to go ahead and give it up for Mr. Blevins himself. There he is, Tyler Blevins aka Ninja. Yes, this is the Ninja Pop. I'm so excited to get this one in my collection. All right. So I do want to preference that I, before, was never a Fortnite person, never really liked Fortnite, did not like Ninja until I like gave it a try. And now, that's pretty much the only video game I play right now is Fortnite. I'm trying to get better at building, all that stuff like that. But this is Ninja himself. Really cool. I'm really excited to get this one in my collection. And I'm really excited to even try to maybe even get this signed because, I mean, I'm not sure if there's going to be any conventions coming out later because of the whole COVID thing, but I definitely want to get this one signed by Ninja. So, I don't know. That, that, that would be pretty cool. I would, I'd really, I'd really like to get this one signed. And it would be my first signed pop if I did get it signed. That is really awesome. Uh, so, Ninja for the win. All right, ladies and gentlemen, we have saved the best for last. And this one right here, I've been waiting on pretty much ever since they announced it. I, I'm i a huge fan of this person. I really like the pops, anything having to do with this character. I really like it. So I'm just going to go ahead and open it and let you see for yourself. Like I said, I've been waiting for this for the longest time. And I will pretty much say that with everything that I open, but it is true. All right. <laughs> Ooh. Woo. Woo. Here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, this is another, another freaking pop that I, I just got to have in my collection. I'm still on the lookout for a few more, but ladies and gentlemen, God dang, look at that. Oh man. All right. So in three, two, one. Bam! There he is, ladies and gentlemen. Mr. Iron Man Tony Stark himself. It is a preview. It's a PX Previews exclusive. It is him with the gauntlet. The last... I ain't even gonna say. Um, this is a really freaking cool pop. I am gonna take this out of the box and let you look at it because it does glow in the dark and I wanna test that on camera and see how well it does because... Uh, I, I'm a huge Iron Man fan, and this one, I don't know, I believe, I don't know, this one, this one just, this one just takes the cake, I guess, I don't know what else to say, but, yeah, Iron Man right here, oh, man, look at this right here on the lid of the pop box, I love you, 3000, oh, man, if you've not seen the movie, go see the movie, the end game. Jesus, I can't, I don't, I want to say stuff, but then I don't, because I don't know who has not watched it, so, oh my god, that's just, woo, fire, 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 look at that, well, check out what glows, but you can kind of see it, see the stuff that glows, you can kind of see it, there you go. I wish it was better, a better glow on that, but it does not do it justice. Oh my god, that looks freaking awesome. Dude, uh, you can still see the glow in it a little bit, if you can, you can, you can see it a little bit. Jeez, look at that. Oh my god. I don't know what else to say. I need to get me another one, just another one in box, another one out of box, just just because, because, I don't know, I don't know why. I'm just rambling, I'm lost for words right now. 
All right, that's my time for now. I'd like to thank you. Oh, wait, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. There is one more package that I need to open, but I cannot open it because it is huge. It will not fit in this space. So I am going to throw on a little uh, video clip of what it is, and then maybe on my Instagram I'll probably post pictures of it built. You'll understand when you see this next video clip. Just like to say thank you very much, James, for sending that my way. Greatly appreciate it. I've been rocking this old ass chair for a long time, and I think it's time for a new one. So I greatly appreciate it. I know it's a birthday gift. Thank you very much, James. Much appreciated. Well, that's my time for now. I'd like to thank you for clicking and watching. Be sure to give this video a like, a comment, and a subscribe. I greatly appreciate it. On the behalf of the Owl's Nest, I'll see you flock collectors in the next one.